welcome, welcome to learn that that how how we can charge cars battery and uh, here we have now this example battery in here and there is there's charger and what you need to do this charging operation is that first you you must have this uh, this of course this car battery and also then you must have a special car charger and I have here a car charger what is uh, what is this uh, 220 volts system and there is also this 110 volt system in US what we can use and and this charger is good because there is this ampere meter and we can uh, check that how much this charger is adding this uh, electricity to this battery and when this this uh, meter is this red line is in here it is it charges this battery very efficiently and the battery is empty or half half of power and when this this metric red red uh, meter is in here then this battery is full okay and and then you can you can charge this battery also in your car but i recommend that you you take this battery out because when we do this uh, battery charging there 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 generates oxide vapors and gas what what are what are dangerous to us and that's that this is the dangerous situation that you you can't charge this car battery inside in your home only in in garage or some cover place in 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 outside because this this battery it generates oxide gases and they go, goes out and you can even smell this this uh, poison gas but in outside like in this area there is no any problems when you start to to charge this battery but but in inside it's it's really uh, really bad thing and and especially this gas is also uh, it is uh, uh, it is flammable and it can generate explosion and let's look a little bit more accurately this battery and there is of course those text what tells that that what what are we now talking firstly this first symbol means that this battery is oxide and it is poison and it, it can generate really really bad hurt to your skin there is hand and 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 you, I recommend that you use some gloves or protect your hands and but don't touch because uh, if there is possibility that if you rotate this battery and this rotation means that that please keep this battery always in that position not not in in that one or not in that one because because then this oxide what is inside of this oxide is inside of this box it comes out in these areas and it, it leaks out and this is the only only good good uh, standing point that it, this battery must stand in this this position not not in like that one not no anymore because then there this oxide comes out quite soon okay and let's let's take a look more this and then there is of course this possibility that when you charge this car's battery this battery uh, can really generate those flammable gases and and then we might have this expo, expo 
exposition, where is this symbol? This third, third one, yellow. And then of course that no, no children. And then we need to use eye, eye protective glasses. And there is information and you can recycle. And then there is important that this battery is lead, lead battery. This is like this old, old style where you can see that this lead, lead means that there is also symbol in here that this is metal, lead. And you, you can recycle this lead. And, and then, then there is this, those last things is that, that this is Russian standard and this B, it's it's new symbol to me. It's it's a, some something something message, but it seems that it is not not warning message. Okay, and um, and what we can then look more. This battery is this this battery has been installed. This magic eye indicator. What is very nice, because we can look inside of this this eye and check that that what is their status. And in this battery, we can see that this inside area is black, and it means that there is this smile in down. This is not happy, and this means that discharge this discharge it, and this means that we need to charge this battery in same way as we charge our cell phone. But this is only a little bit bigger and not so complex battery. And if you have the white area in here, then this battery is totally dead. And, and then we, we drop this battery then to recycle box and garbage. But now, now it indicates that that we need to recharge, and our target is to charge this to green, and, and then this area is in here green. Okay. Okay, and, and, and then... How, how, how you set up these cables? Firstly, when you have this charger, and you could purchase this charger from a car spare part shops and this is not very expensive this cost something like uh, 10 to 20 euros or 20 to 25 US dollars and I recommend that you purchase that one because this this can can uh, longer this your car's battery life like 50 percent to 100 percent because this car battery this cost normally something like 100 euros per battery and if if you charge your battery because this charger is very usable and it, it fits to all kind of uh, uh, cars and even even lorries and tractors and so on and uh, you can charge many many times your car batteries and even if your car battery is empty, you can even charge it to pack. And, and if, if you drive really short, short uh, uh, road and your daily, daily car driving is very short, like five, five miles or seven kilometers per day, then this your battery becomes quite soon really empty because your car's alternator it can't uh, charge this battery so efficiently than this charger and this uh, this charger you can charge this battery like every uh, every 6 month once and and uh, two times per year and then your your car battery is is okay okay and and what to do and how you set up this car charger cables. This is very important because there are two cables and this is the also process how you set up that, that first unplug this uh, 
electric cable and then there is uh, two cables red and black and it's always that red is plus plus and and there is this batteries plus area it is in here you can see there is plus and and here is this minus and this means that that you set up this uh, car batteries red this is very important that this goes in this this plus in this way and please sure that when you set up these cables that, that this is thick then that this there is this really this metallic metallic connection between that and this lead and I recommend that you do in do in that way and then you even little bit move that that there are those scratches. The scratches are okay. And then you set up this black in here and also you rotate this in that way. Okay. And now everything is fine. There is our charger and then I plug in this cable to this uh, to this electricity and let's look this metric what happened I take a little bit okay and now when we look this charger there is this uh, red metric line is it it jumps in there what is like uh, it is like one ampere power and it's it charges now this battery and also we can hear this sound this uh, alt, this charger keeps normally that kind of sounds like this G and and you you can check that is there everything okay that you take this one cable away and then back and and when this metric jumps you know that that now this charger is adding power in here and uh, how how long you should keep this charger on is this like in cell phone like one hour or how much this is the important point this this charger and this bat car battery charging it takes really long time normally this time is uh, at least three hours is the minimum but the maximum is and the current good time is like uh, 10 10 hours it means that one night when you load this in one night then you have full full car battery and then you can leave this battery back to your car and of course if you are a little bit lazy you can charge this battery also in in your car and I will show that also okay and uh, now we go to look how you charge this in, in your car. Okay, okay, and you can also charge your battery in also in that way. That there is this battery, and here is this charger, and you have set up these cables in there. And this is also in fine when you only lift up this hatch and and if you have some garage it is very nice to load battery in that way and this is also possible if you, if you are lazy people but this is this is fine way also okay and this was the how to charge your car battery thank you